Right, a while ago I uh, put out a video where I uh, had a faulty ballon and uh, I actually repaired the ballon. We found a loose connection inside and uh, I never actually got around to testing it after that. So uh, I'm down the field today. Now, as I film this, we are technically still under lockdown in the UK, so we shouldn't really be uh, traveling up and down the country. Um, my main reason for being here actually is uh, we've got a bit of fence over there, which is uh, collapsed and uh, letting the horses out onto the uh, main road bit of a safety issue not just for the horse but for the uh, people driving past as well so uh, primarily I'm here to fix that fence but uh, whilst I'm here I thought I might just uh, plug my radio in here I've got the Icom 703 and uh, tablet computer down here and uh, I thought we'd just do a quick whisper test set that going for half hour whilst I'm uh, fixing the uh, fence over there um i'm not going to do too much in you know i'm not going to go on ssb or anything like that because uh going portable whilst under lockdown just doesn't really seem appropriate but uh i'll show you the setup and uh we'll run a whisper test i'm just interested to see um how well this performs right so there you see my uh, car with my trailer and all my uh tooling on for the uh fence you can just see part of the fence there just in front of the car has collapsed uh mast has been there since uh oof, i put that up last year sometime i think uh top of the mast uh i don't know how well you can see that if i can zoom in there's the ballon at the top and uh it just goes down and you won't be able to see the wire but oh you might just see it there it goes over attaches onto the fence by the road there and then uh, back up to the top of the mast, down the other way, and uh, it attaches onto one of those trees over there. So uh, that's the uh, setup with the antenna. And uh, I've got, uh, I think it's Westflex 103, uh, comes down the mast. And uh, I've just got the radio in the car there. Um, like I said, I set this up, uh, probably last year uh, towards the end of last year before we went into lockdown and uh, just uh, never got a chance to test it so I'm curious to see what it does and uh, just whilst I'm waiting for the uh, tablet computer to boot up just having a scan through and uh, first impressions it seems good uh, got a nice S9 signal there's a QSO going on here on the this is on 80 meters by the way yeah, 80 is a bit quiet at the moment, but it's the wrong time of day for it. I mean, uh, what are we? We're uh, just coming up to quarter to three in the afternoon, so probably not the best time of day for 80 metres, really. Right, so I've had the uh, whisper test running for... It's only run for about 10 minutes, which probably isn't really enough to uh, give us a full uh, picture, but... Uh, it turns out that it's a good idea to charge the uh, battery on the tablet before you come out here. So, uh, unfortunately, the battery just died on the computer. But uh, I've got the uh, plot here on my uh, phone and I'll put it up on the uh, screen when I edit the video. But uh, first impressions are looking good. So I think my repair on the, uh, on the ballon is good. But uh, like I say, the, it's not showing an awful lot of... Uh, receive stations on there but it was only running for 10 minutes so uh, I think if I'd uh, run it for an hour or so you know it would have looked a lot better but I suppose you think about it it's at the end of the day it's a full-size inverted V dipole for 80 meters relatively low to the ground which is pretty much your uh, best case scenario for uh, Envis communications which this is so um, I mean the ends are I don't know probably about two and a half meters off the ground each end and uh, the mast in the center from memory I think was nine meters so uh, it's not quite resonant I need to prune the ends of the antenna just a tiny bit just to uh, bring it into tune it's um, at the moment it's resonant around 3.4 uh, 3.45 megahertz thereabouts so um, it's resonant a little bit low a little bit below the band I'm just using the uh, uh, the tuner on the um on the icon 703 just to rein it in a bit but uh first impressions looking good <laughs> 